with Soriano and I want to show you a pictures about my beautiful ladies here let me share the screen with you um here I'm gonna begin with uh, Carolina so Carolina this is a very pretty picture tell me tell me more about it uh, so this was for a photo shoot, uh, woman empowerment, business. I just got my new job and I was promoting this image of a uh, power woman to kind of put onto my Instagram. Wow. Oh, so this was one of them. Um, so last year I got into 10 magazine covers. This one was one of my favorites, a um, magazine called Lavishly. Uh, yeah, so it, it was an honor to be on their issue. Love it. I told her that you, you're you like very chameleonic, you know, because <laughs> I really so am. Much. That's a chameleon. You're so beautiful. Thank you. This was amazing. I went to an Oscars after party. That's my best friend, Stephanie. Uh, I actually made the dress I'm wearing in this photo. Uh, I am actually a fashion designer on the side. Uh, I had a, my own fashion company for quite a while and my logo and everything is uh, trademarked in the United States of America. So uh, yeah, so right. the, that's, that was from my spring collection last year. Awesome. I'm here. I can oh, see this her, is so... like very, uh, like an event, technology. Yes, a technology event. So this was at NRF and uh, NRF is the national retail uh, technology type of conference and all the technologies from around the world um, come and show their neatest and greatest things. Uh, and a lot of individuals from retail organizations will come over and figure out what types of technology. It's kind of like the RFID I was talking about. So that was something we were showcasing. You can be in the Big Bang Theory next time. <laughs> yeah, a lot of different things. You're in the nerdy. You're in the nerdy. You're in the nerdy world now. <laughs> yeah, I know. I know. Gosh, and still did single. You great. See, did, you see, did you see how she changed? Like very. Yeah. You know, like a strong personality with businesswoman, then very sexy. That's where all the women in my life are like. Oh my God, it's what I love about my there's a, Yeah, there's a song, <laughs> Lady of the Streets, but a freak. You know, that, that, that's kind of like, you know, that's me. I want to <laughs> portray this image of classy lady, but when it comes to me and my future husband in the home, I'm a different person, you know? <laughs> I want I want everybody, um, everybody see her Instagram account. You can, <laughs> you can follow her. Let me show you. Thank you. I really appreciate very, it. Very, very nice Instagram yeah, account. Totally different, different very brand. Very clean, very nice. Thank yeah. you. Very, very clean, nice. very nice. Yeah. I, I gotta know. take down all my Speedo pictures too, I suppose. <laughs> this is 20K followers. Oh my yeah. God. Yeah, I hit that on Saturday. <laughs> now I'm going with um, Ashley. Okay. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I wanted to go to Akata. How do you say kata in English, uh, Korean? How do you say kata? Yeah, kata de vino. Una oh, kata okay. de vino. Oh, tasting, okay. taste, taste uh, wines? Not wine know. tasting. Wine tasting, yes. Okay. The wine tasting. But we're in the wine business too. You guys know that, right? Yes. Oh, I know. I have a bottle of yours. So, oops. Yeah, oops. <laughs> we make I our own wine. One. I was it's telling, very... I told you, Tatiana, we, so we make our own wine. You got a bottle. And I make my own wine here at home in October. Starting October, I start making wine for next year. That's wonderful. I wanted to go to see how you, you know, deal with the wine because it's very special, you know. The process, yeah. yeah. Well, it depends on the winter. If it's nice and cold out, then it's a good, it's a good vintage. But if it's not too wintry, it's not so good. Ashley, I, see, I see a big breakfast in the side. Very, very chilly moment with you. This is oh, this is love. I can't imagine. <laughs> that was in Santorini. I was uh, actually going to ask if that's Santorini. Yeah. yeah. 
And uh, that was right outside our little um, like villa um, overlooking. Do you recommend Santorini as a girls trip or a couples only trip? What do you think? Uh, no, I think you could do it with friends, yeah. with girls. Yeah, it's right. definitely, yeah. And that was me drinking coffee, another mm -hmm. beverage that I can't live without, so. <laughs> Yeah, Santorini is very interesting because it's like, I think it's the, mo the most, uh, or the bigger island and it's like, you know, it's, 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 you can shop around, it's very different than um, Mykonos, my, my but mm -hmm. it's very pretty. And here you, we see... That was just, San, Sam, that was in Santorini again and we, uh, we re had a quad that we drove around the whole time, so that's just showing my adventurous side. <laughs> That's very interesting. And here, that was uh, me just down the shore. I mean, I just like being outside, as you can tell. This is the beach of uh, New Jersey. It's called. Uh, we call it the shore. Yeah, the shore. Yeah. La orilla, the shore. Okay. Oh, that one's beautiful. Oh, wow. uh, that. Uh, yeah, that's another one of me in Santorini. That was the most recent trip we took, actually. Oh, wow. Yeah, um, that was in September. So that, that was, was us at another restaurant. Or me, yeah, that's the best. I think that's the best uh, time to go to the island, to Greek or may, even a visa or in a, the island in Spain because it's in September. It's like very nice temperature, you know. The mm -hmm. weather is nice and no, not too much people around. Yeah. Santorini, yeah. Uh, Santorini is very romantic. Mm -hmm. Yep, yeah, it's fun. Don't say that too loud, because then I have to make a trip there with the business. <laughs> yeah, you have. To. And so, tell me about how did you meet Marco? <laughs> I wanted to know. <laughs> like a gossip show now. Forget about economy. <laughs> what did we meet? Do you guys remember? Between. Uh, it, it was definitely some kind of drunken event. I met Marco. <laughs> <laughs> We have uh, either we have, a drunk barbecue or drunk at the bar. We we have similar friends in common. There's like a group of 50 people in these group chats, and and we all hang out. We have such a blast. So the, all this COVID nonsense right now going on is, you know, really is affecting our our just our ability to go outside and see each other. But we used to get together all the time, thirsty Thursdays, hanging out. You know, various people. So every Marco, week. It's yeah, 50 it, people. We move like like a flock of, of <laughs> we just invade a restaurant and yep. it's us. And take it over. We take yep. over the whole thing. That's right. <laughs> yeah. But he's very charming. I show you guys with okay. this, with, with Soriano, <laughs> in both situation with Carolina and then with Ashley. So Ashley, <laughs> how did you meet him? <laughs> um, I remember it very distinctly because uh, I was dating a guy at the time and I was out in the Hamptons Oh my God. with him and the guy I was dating ended up being a total loser like I, I tell Marco like he's the best thing that came out of the relationship <laughs> because <laughs> I, that's how I met him um, but I was out at this house in the Hamptons and um, Marco knew the owner of the house as did my boyfriend at the time and um, Marco was setting up the DJ booth because there's gonna be a party there and he like showed up early and we, were, we just started talking um, okay. But I wasn't like going to the party or anything. It was just like, I would think I was writing at the time. And you know, you were writing and you were hanging out with your boyfriend and we're staying in this house in the Hampton Bays, which is very typical in, in the summertime. And we got to talking. Yeah. I play, you know, I play live music. So mm -hmm. I was, I was yeah. setting up for that. Yeah. But I just remember him coming up the driveway and I think it was a rented Mercedes or was it yours? Yeah. It was like the convertible, but you're like playing this like, no, 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 that's not right. That's my car. Uh, okay, yeah. but you're playing this like 90s, I think it was like 90s, like, like club music or something. I was like, oh, who is this guy? Yeah, yeah, I love vanilla ice. <laughs> <laughs> Marco, you do many different things, many different talents. You never yeah. cease to amaze me, really. Band, doing the company, the motorcycles, the wine. I mean, I, I don't know how you do it all. I thought I was always busy, but you know, twofold. So that's a compliment to you, seriously. Thank you. You know what I've learned is that the human the human capacity is only limited to the extent that you allow it to. And that's for any person. Yeah. So if you want to really do something, you can. Period. There is everybody always asks it, what about time? Time doesn't matter. You work around it and, and you make it happen, right? Yeah. You gotta balance life, work, fun, fun the art. I most people that I, I know have a great job. And 
they have money, they are not happy. Mm. If you aren't happy with what you do, it's because you're not doing it right. You're not approaching life the right way. Mm -hmm. So take a break. Mm -hmm. This is a good time for a break. And uh, I, I have to tell you that you have a wonderful woman behind you. So that's the secret too. Mm -hmm. But uh, you know, a strong man and intelligent man have a strong woman. And Just not So that's the secret, <laughs> <laughs> of course. Because me, I have three kids and I have to deal with everything. I have a strong man too. So it's the balance. Yeah. But I wanted to show you because that's I how I met Tatiana through her husband, by the way. Oh wow! Okay. Yeah. But I, I was I was out of uh, the the story because I was thinking then I want to share you the pictures and I told you I was thinking wow. that Ashley met Marco in the Fox News. I know <laughs> that. Um, before that. About, um, oh. Economy. Amazing. Look here, <laughs> long hair. <laughs> yep, I remember that. And here is another channel. <laughs> so awesome. They're all different. Marco, yeah. Marco tell me about day. All those. Oh, cool. um, Marco, how do you get on this? these roads? Uh, I'm just, you know, people like my <laughs> face and then what I have. <laughs> yeah, I, I, um, this is this is called Money Watch. This is CBS. This is an Italian channel. Uh, mm -hmm. The ones before were Fox News as well as I've been on ABC, you know, and I don't know, I just come there, I'll tell people the way I see the market. This is called Voices of America, VOA, which is translated in 20 different languages. And as an economist, you know, what I try to do is always and this tell is, people what and not I to saw, do. And I saw that uh, Carolina and Marco were sharing, you know, a drink and Marco had their first cigar for the season. <laughs> That is me. I, I, I like don't the suit much. Very nice fashion. I don't smoke much, but yeah, yeah, one cigar I, I, per year. Well, month. that's very interesting how people know each other, you know? Connectors, we connect. It's we all about being positive, you know, maintaining a positive view. You know, a lot of people are concerned about this, this, this situation today, but we have to understand, especially mm -hmm. in New York. We had 9-11. We, we, two of our towers took down, taken down. We had the, the blackout in New York City. When Imagine New York City in complete darkness, we had it. We had uh, so many other different crises that this thing, honestly, it feels bad, but we're gonna just come right back. You know, one. this is a, a statistical point. In the last 40 years, the economy has gone through bad recessions, 75% of the time, the economy has rebound and has outperformed, 75%. So the chances that this is going to take us out or it's going to create a bad situation is, is unlikely based on the statistics. And I think already people are ready to go to work, ready to, you know, get things started and charge. So um, I'm very optimistic about all of that and what I keep telling the clients. Reset yourself, reposition yourselves in the market, learn as much as you can. You're home now. You can exactly. learn about so many things because everything is accessible. Learn and get back to market, reinvent yourselves, mm -hmm. and you'll be fine. You know what? I was thinking about invest in um, fashion and technology because I was searching, and it's kind of a very nice uh, mask, intelligent mask an intelligent clothes for the, this situation that we are dealing with. Mm -hmm. And Marco, do you think that this is interesting uh, investing in this? Listen, I don't know about the whole thing covering your face the whole time. I think part of the business interaction or any type of relationship is to be able to see a person in the eye and be able to see facial expressions, right? One thing, one element that takes away from this experience is when you're on the phone or you're texting because you're not interacting with people. Any business, it's a relationship business. That's where it starts. Then you can add knowledge, then you can add the experience, of course, but it starts with a relationship. Otherwise, it won't last. So covering your face, covering your eyes, and all of this will take away that element, and it could be pros and cons that you have to uh, 
take a look into it. I have a question for each of you. What do you think about the handshake going away in business? I read an article a few days ago and the handshake, they want to do away with this common um, common tradition in business. Like any religion, you have to respect, right? The distance sometimes, so you have to respect what the other people believe. So it's a belief, really. Whether you believe this is gonna save you from dying or it's gonna save you from anything else. So if you're, if you and I, if I see you, I'm not, I'm gonna hug you. Yeah, I agree. I'm yeah. gonna hug you, actually. I'm gonna hug you, Tatiana. You know, but that's a belief that we're in. Now, if you're paranoid about it, then you know what? I'll throw a piece of paper at you. <laughs> <laughs> Virtual I'm hug. I'm very scared. I'm very scared when I see people. You know, like. And I wanted to hug the people, uh, the person, and he's, um, she told me, a, a friend of mine he, who came yeah. another day here to install a TV in my in my room. And I was like, I want to hug him. And she, uh, he was with her, her girl. And, and the girl was, wait, 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 don't touch, don't touch. And I was like, you know. You got to grab a, a big yeah. sheet of, uh, of your bed and just wrap him around it and then hug him. <laughs> it's crazy. <laughs> <laughs> Whatever. This is like I said. It's gonna. It's change the belief system. Everything we live in today is a belief system. Whether it's politics, whether it's religion, whether it's the way you were brought up by your own parents. So you, you have, have to read it. Do not to ever kiss or hug anybody. Come on, that's not gonna happen. I would. I would not agree with that. You know, we're not in those times, you know, so I don't know. Another, I, I, would, another, I kiss my kids another, every, day, every day. Yeah, I saw uh, other um, technology in, invention. It was like a swimsuit because I'm here in Florida, so I'm in swimsuit all the time, even now in the, this situation. And yeah. the swimsuit is intelligent and tell me how can use the uh, sun cream and how often I have to put it in my skin. Wow. Am I gonna see pictures of you guys in bikinis? Because that's awesome. <laughs> <laughs> I'm ready. <laughs> well, send us the intelligent bikini, please, and we can share with you pictures. <laughs> well, so the bikini, the bathing suit tells you when you need to put on the sunscreen again. Wow, yeah. that's... Wow. That's very nice. And I'm to a Mediterranean man. I'll burn no matter what. <laughs> I, don't, I like the sun. You, yeah. By August, this forget it. I'll be cousins with Barack Obama. <laughs> so um, let's talk about security. Security in the in our uh, business in our home, since we are dealing with this. A Zoom connection or Google or everything that we're trying to connect, even the school. I lost my file from my computer like two weeks ago. I have nothing. I don't know how and what and what happened. I found in my desktop all my files, but when I go inside, I have nothing. What do you think about that? Listen, statistically, and I'll, and I'll go around with you guys. So statistically speaking, the number of devices that we will have access to in the next 10 years is going to go exponentially. So right now, as we speak, you probably have already five devices at home that are connected to the website, so it's connected to the internet, where anybody can jump in and, and steal your information. This number is supposed to go up by 500% in the next 10 years. So that means you're gonna be over exposing yourself to cyber attacks by all means. So cyber security is gonna be an industry that is gonna tremendously grow. And, and you can talk about your own anecdotes because for example, you, it happened through you that in Zoom and they're taking measurements, everybody Zoom and everybody's good use in Google Hangout people can come through the back end of this if it's not secure and access your information so it's really scary times i know ashley you told me it just happened to you can you tell us more about your experience what you have to do and i'm sorry to bring this up i know it's sad. Uh, ashley, i have to tell you that we have to go to commercial break again but we come back with your story and your experience about the security system at home
Also yeah. think about uh, Alexa or the vacuum machine that we are around that we're controlling with the telephone, you know? It's like, it's everything, we're connected with a few devices at home, but it's, this is very uh, scary too. So I wanted to share with you another um, images here. Uh, here. And I want to tell you that Soriano Group, we care of your financial security with long track record of experience in, in investment portfolios, stocks, bonds, and mutual funds, insurance and annualities, pension retirement funds, education planning, lending all over the United States, all accounts online and mobile devices, secure portal and access point to your accounts. Visit us. Uh, now at sorianogroup.com or write us directly at corporate at sorianogroup.com. Remember, at Soriano Group, efficiency, simple, and secure with your invest. We will have a break, but we will be back in a few minutes with more of having coffee with Soriano at cafeclubradio.com. Amen. <laughs> 